demonstrate how to set the tide functions in the Freestyle Mariner Tide Watch. The current screen is the main screen which shows the, the day, the date, and the time. In order, we can't set the tide functions in the main screen. We have to go to the tide screen. So I press the three button, the mode button, and tide flashes. And it tells us that we're using the Napili Maui uh, location. And this is the current tide graph. So now we're in the tide screens and I can press the four button on any one of the tide screens, hold it for four seconds, and then the tide location will flash. And it'll tell us where we are now. There are nine presets in the um, in the favorites, and uh, right now my favorites are favorites are Seaside, Sydney, Australia, Newport, Napili, Maui, Ala Moana, Lahaina, Maui, Malaya Harbor, Honolulu Bay, Christmas Island. So uh, the only I want to set a, a custom um, favorite. I want to do Arch Cape, Oregon, which is about 13 miles south of Seaside. So we're going to keep Seaside, and let's go down to Sydney, Australia. I don't use Sydney, so I'm going to change this Sydney, Sydney, Australia, the second preset, to Arch Cape. So we're going to select that. What happens now is the the region flashes. There are a number of regions. Uh, we want the West Coast region, so we go, use the up or the down button, one or two, to move through the... Uh, there's the U.S. Uh, West Coast. That's the one that we want. So we're going to select that. Now, there, these are the various tide locations. There are a number. Most of them are in California. Um, um, but we there are a couple in Oregon. There's Newport and Seaside. There are a couple in Washington. Um, we're going to go back down to and use the Seaside location. This is closest to Arch Cape. Uh, it's about 13 miles away, whereas Newport's about 50 miles away. So this is the closest to our custom location, so I'm going to select that. It's asking me if I want to use daylight savings time or, or turn it off or on myself. But we're going to use let the watch do the daylight savings time. Uh, it's asking us if we want to offset the time. I've checked the tide tables, and uh, the high tide and the tide time in Seaside are the same as Oswald West, which is right below Arch Cape. So there's no time offset, but I could move the time up or down um, in increments of 10 minutes all the way to 180 uh, minutes, both negative and positive. So we're going to, there's no offset, so we'll select that. It is asking if we want to do a custom location. I press the up button because yes, we do. There we go. So we're going to change the seaside to um, Arch Cape. So the, the cursor is flashing here. It's blank. So I hit the up button once. It gives me the A. I press the three button to accept that. Uh, the next one is, is um, Arch AR. So I go down one, select that. Um, then it's ARC. So we want to go down to C here, accept that. And then A, we want to take that up to H and uh, accept that. Now that I want to put a blank here, if I hold the, bu the uh, one button down, um, it moves quickly, the two button down, it moves quickly backwards, and we'll go down to A quickly, and then we know that the blank is is uh, right next to the A, there's, there's the blank, we want to accept that, and then we want to change the I to a C, we'll go down, DC, okay, we'll accept that. And then this uh, D, we want to take that down to an A. There we go, we'll accept that. And the E, we want to take up to P. I'll hold it down tight and see if we can't get it. Uh, we're close there, P Cape. We accept that. And then we have a blank here, and I just want to do A, B, C, D, E. So there we're set at Arch Cape. We're going to now accept that. And there's our favorite number two, Arch Cape. And this shows the uh, current uh, tide graft. Um, let's see. I'm sorry. I'm going to go this one. This is the next tide. And then if I press it again, it'll give me the sunrise at Arch Cape and then the sunset at Arch Cape. And then it'll bring you back to the main tide mode. This is the current tide mode in Arch Cape. Um, and this tells us what the, that we are, have a rising tide. The high tide will be here. Uh, the next low tide will be here. So um, that's good. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and press the main, the uh, mode button number three, and it'll take us back to the current time. 
So this, our tide is now set, um, if I press the tide button here, it, this tells me what the current tide, tide is in Arch Cape, but the issue here is that we are um, in uh, Maui now at Napili, so I'm going to change this back to the Napili preset. So in order to do that, I have to, to change things, I have to be in the tide mode. So I press the three button once, it gives me the tide mode, it tells us we're in Arch Cape, and it gives us the current tide. So I can change that preset now by pressing the four button for four seconds, and it'll set the tide location. We're now at Arch Cape, but we know that we want to be at Napili, three, Newport, four, Napili. That's the one we want. So Napili flashes, and then the current tide graph uh, occurs, it shows us that we're in the middle of low tide right now. It's, it's 1030, and um, if I wanted to uh, see what the next tide was, I press this button, the uh, four button. This tells us that the next tide is a uh, high tide of 2.7 feet at 439 a.m., or I can check and see what the sunrise is, 706 in the morning, the sunset tomorrow is 615, and then we'll, or go back to the main. Uh, tide. So um, that's how this works. Um, I hope this is helpful. Uh, enjoy your watch and please subscribe to my um, channel.